Hey everyone, welcome back to Ebony with Genghis. So a couple things here, big update, Shalons is coming, but the most important part of that is actually that new continents. But here, just to recap from yesterday's video, a little continuation, so many people sent me this image, thank you. Looking, there is, there is a plunder quest, and you can see it right there, plunder resources from other players, so why have that sort of stuff and punish us? Also, someone said, I, th I found this funny, I forgot this, Attila and Amir generals in the game that are designed for plunder so now let's look at the shallans the new alliance city it will have attacking ground and mount buffs that's pretty cool if you get top 100 and then at the bottom here the new sub that's going to be offered persia attacking troop attack defense and hp five percent and then ground and mount attack and hp eight percent so basically 13% for ground and mount HP attack, and then 5% for everything else. Pretty good city. This will be ultimate war season. That's pretty cool. People will be happy with that for obvious uh, Wonder 3 achievements, getting top 200. And then the big news, if you look at this, six continents. So, well, there always was six, sorry, but the numbers changed. C6 got ch cut in half. So if we look at the top, C... One now goes to 368, which ironically, just uh, about three weeks ago, I think we merged with 340. And I remember saying at the time, I wish we took their number because I'd rather move up to C1. I just think it suits our style of play more if you catch what I'm saying. And C2 now is up to 610 and that will include Val. So let's see how they do in C2. A lot of debate on how that will go. And C3 now includes, I believe WDF is in the 850s. So they are in there. I might be wrong. Let me know. And then the big thing is C5 is now going to include Neo and Septius and a couple other big boys. Not sure if Fahad's in there. I think he probably is grouped with them. And C6, as it should be, is like the little baby continent it should be it shouldn't be for people who are more than like 14 months old maybe like you know like it's a 12 month that's how it should be it's a massive disadvantage for someone who's playing for eight months to go up against someone who's playing for a year and a half it's not quite the same as someone who's been playing for three years going against someone who's been playing for four years right so c6 should always be you know shifting people to c5 I don't know why they had to do this though. I really think like uh, maybe, Ebony, uh, do we really need six continents anymore? I think you could shrink a lot of this stuff down because player base seems to be dwindling. Coin strike coming, player base unhappy. Uh, yeah, just start merging, merging a lot and uh, shrinking this down. You could go with like four continents, I'm sure. Anyways, that's my thoughts on this. I am excited to see how it shapes out. I always like playing with new people in All-Stars for one round, right? Because I get eliminated quickly. Anyways, let me know in the comments your thoughts on it all and like, subscribe, leave a comment.